Hi, welcome to Fight League TV, and I'm your host, Jalissa Flores, and I'm so lucky to be here with Layla Mikar, current champion. Thank you for having me. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here. Tell me all your stories about fighting and your passion about it. I grew up in the martial arts background. I ended up taking American Kempo Karate for a total of nine years in my childhood, and that was my main martial art. Transitioned into full contact karate, kickboxing, uh, the evolution of the fight, as they say, and um, ended up in boxing when I was about 15. I took it all the way, and it's just been a really excellent journey. I love the sound of that. I'm just so happy to be in front of a woman and to be speaking to a woman. It's just so nice. Me too, woman power. <laughs> yes. So tell me, Layla, how many times have you been a champion? I'm a current world champion in boxing, and I was an eight-time world champion in five different weight classes. I won my first world title in 2000. Um, in the year 2000, I was 21 years old, and I was the youngest champion ever. That's amazing. I love that. Can I ask you a question? Have you ever had a fight a man? I'm um, only in the gym. Thankfully, but you know, we have some good wars in the gym and I, I spar with good professional male fighters with 30, 40 professional fights and that, that's, that's what I prefer because they make me better. Early on, I never had the opportunity to spar with women. We didn't have uh, women in the gym. So Layla, did the guys get mad when you give them a little? Of course, it's never good for the male ego to be bruised or you know, to be beat up by a female in the gym, but they recognize me as a, as a world champion and they, a lot of men come up to me and just say how much they've learned from me and that you know, I'm a great fighter with a lot of experience. And they, you know, the whole woman, man thing goes out the window. A left hook's a left hook, you know. You live in Vegas currently? Yeah, I moved to Las Vegas in uh, February of 2000 uh, because it's the boxing capital of the world and I wanted to give my career a real chance. I turned pro up in Spokane, Washington. I had six pro fights and then I moved here. And I met the great manager, Luis Tapia, who also trained me. So it's been wild, you know. I'm, I also play poker here in Las Vegas professionally. So. so tell me, what do you think about bare knuckle fighting? Well, I think it's, uh, it's a very tough sport, you know. Only the gritty can survive. You know, life is a fight. So, you know, you get knocked down, you get back up. That's what fighting's about. And bare knuckle fighting is the extreme to that point. That it, It's awesome, you know. That's, that's what people love to see. Action, knockouts, um, power, and grit. I'm looking forward to seeing what Bare Knuckle Fight League brings, bringing the best, uh, toughest guys to come and improve themselves. It's going to be a great show and a great experience. I, I can't wait to see it. I am so impressed with you, Layla, and everything that you have said like really touched me right now. And I literally, I'm like mesmerized. <laughs> Thank you again for being here and for taking the time to for Bare Knuckle Fight League. I really appreciate you and I'm excited to see you June 1st. Yeah, I hope to be there June 1st at the fight compound and uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what Bare Knuckle Fight League has to offer. It's going to be great.